I'm Dave Salmoni for Animal Planet, and these are your Animal Bites. In the news, a mother and son were attacked by a giraffe. This is very uncommon. Giraffe are a very calm, relaxed animal, typically. The basics are, this father was out, mom and son were waiting for him to come home. They lived in a reserve in South Africa, and they seemed to be very educated, knowledgeable people on wildlife. We do know that the giraffe had a baby about two months old. Typically speaking, a female giraffe with a calf that's two months old, they would just run away from a threat. So we don't know exactly what caused this particular incident. We know that the mother and son are in critical but stable condition. Uh, and we know that the family is looking at this as just an unfortunate accident of nature. I think this is just a great reminder that wild animals are wild and we can't predict everything that they're going to do. They all can be dangerous. Giraffes are not predatory animals and they're not typically aggressive. They will run before they stand and fight. Typically, the only time that they stand and fight is when they've just given birth because within the first hour, the baby giraffe can't move. It's a startling birth because a baby giraffe, when born, have to drop five and a half feet because moms deliver standing up. Now, a human being has seven vertebrae in its neck. Do you know how many vertebrae a giraffe has? Seven. Same number as people, just much, much bigger. You wanna know how to identify a male or female adult giraffe? Well, look at the horns. A female has tufts of hair and a male has bald horns. And the males go bald because they hit each other, they spar, they'll ram their horns into the neck of other male giraffes as uh, sparring to see who gets to have the females. Uh, so they do it so much, they lose the hair on the top of their horns. Do you know what a group of giraffe is called? Now, if you say tower, you get a mark, but you don't get full marks. What I think is the best name for a group of giraffe is a journey. Thanks for joining. We'll see you next time.